time to get some common sense with Craig Bolanos, the CEO and founder of Wealth Management Group. Craig, good to see you. 2022 has been a rocky year for investors. Is this a time when Americans should be investing their money in the U.S. or overseas? Angela, you're right. Geography is always important. And two, it's a lesson in portfolio construction. The war in Europe is the most significant crisis in decades. Food security, energy policy, those are the most obvious concerns. The conflict has proven to be absolutely protracted. And as a result, we've seen a rewiring, if you may, of global ties in a fragmenting world. This clearly has created a set of economic impingements that are unique to develop Europe, primarily, of course, because of their dependency on Russian energy production. You know, for that reason, we think it's really important that investors take a look at ensuring that they already have been and continue to be underweight European equities as compared to broad-based U.S. investment thematics. What else do you see happening? Because there is an importance of being diversified, holding cash, stocks, bonds, commodities. But what about including global investments to really be diversified all the way? Well, certainly history has shown that diversification is the only free lunch when it comes to investing. But at the Wealth Management Group, we always speak about being diversified, but doing it with a purpose. And that doesn't mean investors need to be completely agnostic when it comes to foreign investments, but subscribing to this idea that in today's environment, someone should have 20, 30, 40% of their capital overseas just doesn't make a lot of sense. I mean, case in point, let's just narrow the focus to increase the impact on one simple discussion. Let's look to the other side of the pond, like the UK. There's a new prime minister, Liz Truss, making her just the third female leader of that country, you know, on the backs of Thatcher and May. But she comes into leadership right now under a firestorm of problems, an energy-driven cost of living crisis, annual inflation over 10%, labor issues and strikes that are happening all throughout the country, and add to this the complexity of currency transactions, what I call a strong U.S. dollar. It just makes it really tough for U.S.-based investors to have a lot of confidence over the near term relative to investing overseas. That being said, what do we suggest? Have a U.S.-centric portfolio today and be patient and wait for prices to get even cheaper in foreign markets and look at the strength of the U.S. dollar before making larger capital allocations abroad. I'm Craig Bolanos, the CEO and founder of Wealth Management Group. If you'd like to learn more, you can go to our website, investwithwmg.com. Go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.